When I'm playing basketball, I feel most at peace. Adrenaline and the feeling of like moreness. When I'm confident in my fencing, watch out. When you're confident in yourself, the world should watch out because you're gonna accomplish anything you wanna do. This is why sports is so powerful because this is the place where we can all connect together and we can see each other's humanity. Sport, I'm sure, has saved so many people in this room, right. saved people on this stage, but at the same time, there's this additional trauma. LGBTQI plus people are being targeted and politicized in a very new way, and sport is being politicized in a very new way. This weekend is all about building that safety and that solidarity so that we can withstand whatever risks or pressure or fear comes our way. It's so imperative that LGBTQ student athletes are A, telling their own stories, and B, are being heard while doing to be able to be a collegiate and openly queer athlete is something I pride myself in deeply. I'm not gonna always be there with every little section of my team every time. I'm always gonna be in the locker room. So allyship helps defend the voices of queer athletes when they're not in the rooms and just helps build that environment. This work is important to Adidas because we believe that through sport we have the power to change lives. What we have seen is that if athletes are systematically excluded from sport, we're not really changing all lives. I want every single kid and every single adult to have access to the life-saving power of sport. We know why, we know why, we know why. But oftentimes we don't take the time to pause and actually think about what we want to accomplish and how we're going to get there. This weekend we are at the second annual Athlete Activism Summit. So this is where we give that knowledge, where we build that community, and hopefully sustain this movement and this work for years to come. This space is special and unique because it's the only one. The need for community is what drove us there last year, and the want to spread that community is what brought us here this year. I know the power that I have. I know my purpose is bigger than just putting the ball through the net. And thank God I've been able to use sport to show my purpose to a lot of people. We're going to bring a lot of heat to our admin. We're going to bring a lot of fire to the chapter with new ideas and new initiatives. And we're going to bring a lot of love and a lot of open arms to new people because we're going to be like, come the frick inside and join us. Yeah, it might be a little hard for me, but it won't be as hard for the next person. And that's really what I'm in for. I want it to be easier for people who look like me, think like me, and feel like me. The most exciting part of being here has been being around so many trans people. I've never been around so many trans people in my life before. Joy and play are some of the purest forms of resistance. A life well lived and a beautiful life in the face of hate and fear is one of the most powerful ways that we can continue to resist. We probably won't see the end of transphobia and homophobia in sports in my lifetime, but I know that we will work every single day to make that a reality. There's still moments in the media where it's like, this is the first athlete who's ever come out in this state, in this sport, at this level, who's medaled, who's podium. And I'm so inspired and excited to be a part of that era of firsts and to hopefully create many more of them with the folks in this room. It is our job as activists, as organizers, as elected officials, as athlete allies, whatever we are, it is our job to move the boundaries of what is seen as possible. We are in a very unique moment where student athletes have such tremendous power and potential to use their platforms to create tremendous shifts in how we see and understand athletes. I wanna thank you all for having the courage to show up, for going towards the fear, for being vulnerable this weekend. I wanna thank Adidas, UW, all of our sponsors for being visible. Thank you all so much for everything. My hope for all of you is that you will leave a legacy that is defined by how you impacted your culture more than how you showed up in competition.